welcome back to the channel. My name is Katie, and if you saw the title of today's video, we are staying on the Robin Hood listing, and I have what I think could be some interesting information for you guys. You guys know your girl has been on it. I am so big right now and so bullish on this Robin Hood listing and what it's gonna do for the Shiba Ina community, the project as a whole, and especially, most importantly to us, the price. So what am I talking about? Well, we know that Robin Hood has been teasing for a few weeks that they will be putting up Shiba Inu. Now, you guys remember, I was following the situation with Kraken, and Kraken not only was teasing it, but finally said, if we get like 2,000 likes, we'll go ahead and list it, and they got like 80,000. And so they said, okay, well, we're gonna work on it. And we were all very mad. Now, we had to wait about a month, but Kraken finally did list it, and in that time, they teased more and more and more. Well, Robin Hood says, well, we're not in a race or a rush to list anything until we know that there's regulatory clarity and that they have all their ducks in a row. I don't know that I really believe that they care about all that. I'm looking at you, GameStop and AMC, Robin Hood. However, when it comes to Robin Hood, they're saying one thing and they're doing another. And this is where people like me come in. We read between the lines to show you what's going on and what these companies, corporations, CEOs, politicians, business people, celebrities, what they are saying and what we can gather from it so we know what to do with our money and where to invest it. So I'm gonna jump on, I'll give you a little backstory and explain what's going on and explain what I found. But before we do guys, I'm giving away a $100 gift card and it's very simple. This is all you have to do to be entered and eligible. Like the video, subscribe, hit notifications, comment, share the content, watch the video from start to finish, boom, you're entered, you're eligible, that's all you have to do. Now guys, make sure and do it for every video you see because the more likes, the more comments, the more shares, the more times you watch from start to finish, the more chances you have of winning because the more times you are entered. I'll announce one winner on Sunday, my channel's still so small, you have such a good shot to be able to get my money, good luck. So what am I talking about? Well, let's go back a little bit. So. One thing I've talked about is that many times before a company is going to do something like a big listing or they're going to do a big announcement of something, they end up having lots of maintenance issues. And that's what we've been seeing with Robinhood. You guys know last week, I went ahead and covered that Robinhood with crypto trading, it was down for a while. And then I talked about how they actually do maintenance on their crypto side twice a day. Now, I've talked about that seems a little excessive. Now, some websites will take some time out every day to have at least a slot to do that with. That can be normal, but I don't know. Like, they're with, with their crypto, because they only have seven types of crypto and they have no wallets, it doesn't really make sense to me, right? We also have the fact that they're about, they're going to be releasing soon having crypto wallets as well. They have something soon coming where you will be able to transfer money easier. Now crypto, a wallet is just a place for crypto where you can hold your money, sell your money, transfer your money. Right now you can just buy the crypto and do nothing with it. So seeing that these two things go hand in hand along with a Shiba Inu listing that they've been teasing, I think all these things are about to get released soon. And I think that might be why we are seeing more and more tech issues, maintenance issues when it comes to Robinhood. Let's get on my computer and let's see what I'm talking about. So now guys, I want you to understand that Robinhood has like three different Twitters and Robinhood app. So this is the main Twitter right here. And on the main Twitter, I want to go back a little bit because they retweeted from Robinhood help people who are having issues, right? This is what it says. This is from December 1st. It says we're investigating an issue that's affecting crypto trading and working to resolve it as soon as possible for updates, check status.robinhood. Then again, it says, Crypto trading is now fully restored for all customers. We'll continue to monitor the situation closely. We're sorry for any inconvenience you may have experienced and we are here to help if you have any outstanding issues gives you contact. Now, that all seems like it was cleared up, but then this comes up, because y'all know I look around every day to see what is going on. So as of 22 hours ago, depending on when this goes up, we're invest, and, and this is from Robinhood. Robinhood retweeted, ask Robinhood, they retweeted help. And so it says we're investigating reports that some customers are experiencing issues transferring money in and out of Robinhood and linking bank accounts. We're working to resolve this as soon as possible. We'll post updates here. And then it's about six hours later, we fixed an issue that affected bank 
linking and transferring funds. You should be able to link your bank account and transfer funds from the app as normal. We're sorry for any inconvenience and we are still here to help. Now, and then again, if you actually go to just the Robinhood Ask Help page, and I just want you guys to be able to see it, you can see all of this right here. You can see from recently to December 1st what they have put up. Now, here's what I think is interesting. We have these things fairly quickly, right? From December 1st to December 7th, we've got two, we've got these two issues that comes up. And before that, November 11th was the last time that they had an issue, right? So let me tell you what I, what kind of what I'm wondering what I think this might mean. Well, as if you guys have followed my channel, you know that these transferring, this whole thing about them doing some transfers, this new thing they're coming out. They said they're going to launch this early 2022, which has had me speculate because so many of us have wondered when this is all going to go down if they're not going to be releasing these transfers, these wallets, and Shiba Inu all at the same time as one big promotional push. Now, I could see them maybe doing one and not the other or two and not the other because they're maybe trying to capitalize more on PR, but I would think putting both of those together, especially the wallets, with the Shiba Inu coin, they know if they do anything with Shiba Inu, it's going to blow up. So the fact that they now have wallets and transfers and everything is easier, it wouldn't make sense to me if these two things didn't go, or three things really, didn't go hand in hand when they finally release them. Now, is what we're seeing with all of these technical issues happening back to back now, and the fact that not is it only on the Robin Hood help Twitter, but it's also on the main page, they're retweeting it, it's such a big issue, and they're doing so much maintenance on the crypto side. Are these more signs that we are about to get a Shiba Inu listing and those wallets? And remember guys, those wallets are so important because they now have a wait list. The last time we checked in November, 1.6 million people on Robinhood are on a wait list for the cryptocurrency wallets. It's probably up to 2 million people now. That's 2 million people who are most likely going to just flood the market with cash with Shiba Inu when it's listed. Robinhood knows this. Robinhood knows they're going to capitalize. One thing I can say is I think for them to try to get all everything, all the technicals together all at once is very responsible, but I also think they took way too much time. Why on earth would you have any type of crypto buying or trading if there's no wallet? Robinhood doesn't always make a lot of sense to me, but this is what I found and I wanted to ask, what do you guys think? Considering they don't have a ton of technical issues that you can see, and if they do, they're pretty spread out. What about two within a week of each other? And it has to do with the things that they're going to be releasing more stuff for crypto, more crypto, and these transferring of bank accounts, linking bank accounts. Do you think this is all related? And do you think this is just a sign that they are on the back end of the website with the software? They are actually upgrading things and we are about to get these releases. And with that, we're about to get the listing for Shiba Inu. Sound off in the comments, let me know. You guys know I'm always so curious what you have to say and what you think. And guys, if you would like to support this video and you wanna win my money, it's free. This is all you have to do. Like the video, subscribe, hit notifications, comment, share the content, boom. You are entered, you're eligible, that's all you have to do. And remember, make sure and do it for every video you see. The more likes, the more comments, the more shares, the more times you watch from start to finish, the more chances you have of winning because you will be entered. I'll announce one winner on Sunday. Make sure and watch all of Sunday's videos as a result to see if you won. I just announced some winners for Sunday's videos, so go check them out and see if you won. My channel's still small, you have a good shot, good luck. Okay guys, lots of videos coming out the pipeline today, lots of videos this week, so much Shiba Inu news to keep up with, and I'm gonna be branching out to other things here soon. So what kind of coins am I gonna bring you and what type of tips to help you make money? You'll just have to keep watching because you guys know I am dedicated to helping all of you get in your best and highest health and best and highest wealth. And why is that? Because we deserve it. We don't need to be controlled or owned by psychopaths at the top who've convinced us to give all our money and power to them and that we need to be slave labor and slave wages. That time is over and I wanna raise my voice to help get you guys out of the situation we've been unfairly put in and empower ourselves to make the lives that we deserve simply because we exist. Okay guys, take care, lots of love, lots of blessings. Till the next video, give me all hugs, kisses, stay safe and I'll see you soon. Bye.